We're here with uh, Rule Polis and of the team Cannondale. Rule, we're at Delby Forest, first World Cup. How was your preparation? Oh, the preparation of the whole winter was pretty good. And we had uh, actually a pretty nice travel to the US okay, and back. Yeah, a pretty adventure. Minutes, like, uh, go back. Your the plan was to fly there. back from San Francisco, Amsterdam, Amsterdam Leeds. Then the, the, the last the flight was cancelled as we traveled uh, so with the ferry the from Rotterdam to Hull. The and on the end, it was not so bad. We just tried to recover from the jet lag, minute, two, but starts. with all the focus on the race, it's, it's not that difficult. Laps. You already uh, did the track once or two, two times. How is the track for you? And, uh, it's all kind of style, like it's uh, kind of BMX. And, uh, it's on a uh, fun ride, it's, there is a long climb in there. It's for 90% handmade, like and also waterproof. I think it's a good example of a new kind of uh, mountain bike track. Okay, so you like it? I like it a lot, yeah. You're busy with the preparation for uh, the Olympics. Um, what are your goals for this year to prepare for next, for next year? I want uh, to try to make a podium spot in the, in the World Cup. I was close last year. It's not getting easier with the young guys. The, the young guys getting stronger, that's normal. I'm getting older. But I proved that I'm the whole season I'm doing top five spots. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling comfortable with the team. I think that's important and uh, I will have some results this season. I'm for now you're an example in Belgium. Um, what do you think of the Belgium races for the moment? Uh, I, they're not bad. They have physically they have the same skills as, as the as the other countries, but they're not so focused on uh, on the technical part of the sport. And some of them they take it too serious. Like they lose, they're too serious already in January, and I see that they they lose the focus when it's really important and they could change it, they could improve a lot in that kind of stuff. Um, what are your biggest um, competitors for this season? Uh, I or have so who? many. <laughs> <laughs> for sure it's gonna be Julia is outstanding anyway. <laughs> then uh, I saw a really strong Barry Stander. Christoph Sauce is gonna be in the front, I think he's stronger than last year again. I hope myself to be in front. Hermida, Nev, uh, my team colleagues, Fumik is really motivated, Fonzi is one year older and strong, so I think these are the riders for the top 10. So you say the top is bigger than last year? You never know, there's always somebody who has physically a problem, like with my other teammate has that problem with the knee, for sure there will be somebody else has a, having a problem and come with new guys coming in. I saw Alexis Fouillemont riding really well in the Swiss Cup as one of the new guys. There's, there are always going to be changes. And what is your top goal for this season? No! One podium place or the World, World, Cup, World Championships? World Championships is difficult because it's the last race of a six week block and it's all cross country before. Because I, have, It's not that easy for me to prepare for a five hour race if you have to do the month before like two hour races. But it's, I'm the current world champion. I want to prove myself again and make the best out of it. Okay, we wish you good luck. I hope to see you okay. in the front for the season. Okay. Thank you.